Hey guys, welcome back. So Jojo Day once again, about to dive into episode number 28 of Diamond is Unbreakable. Episode 28, can you believe it? It's, it's gone so quick. This one is called Highway Go Go Part 1. So last episode, I'm an alien. We had Josuke team up with an elf looking dude who was an alien, but he looked a lot like Legolas from Lord of the Rings. Turns out he's a shapeshifter and can become anything. So Josuke's first go-to was to have him turn into dice so he could challenge Rohan to a game, beat him, and make a lot of money. So, interesting. That that was a weird episode. I didn't think it was going to go that way. But that's why I love this show so much, because it just is so crazy nuts and bonkers. That's why we all love it. So, let's just dive into this episode now, part one. So, I think it's going to continue on with the dice game, because, you know, it was a cliffhanger. It was, it was dice. Gambling. It's weird. So weird. Anyway, let's dive into this one. As you know, it's a timer based reaction. So grab your copy and watch along, or you can join my Patreon and get early release content. Usually two to three weeks ahead of YouTube. And um, yeah, all the perks. Okay, let's dive into this episode. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, it's, um, it's a cliffhanger moment. Because he keeps. Earning a lot of money. What's he going to do to the dice? Oh, he's going to drown the alien. He's going to wash him. <laughs> yeah, they are. they got eyes. Oh, they see. But um, but um. So Rohan is getting royally beaten right now. Because the dice alien wasn't holding back. But he's way ahead. Wow. <laughs> How does he have control of the other two two dice? This is super awkward. What? So Kira's kind of kind of front and center there for a few seconds. Breakdown. Love the poses. I love this one. It's a great opening. The song's awesome. Jojo. All the stands. Cool. Highway Go Go Part 1. He just chopped, he just stabbed himself in the finger. Oh my god. So you took it out on yourself?
And it's a bit of a nutty move, man. <laughs> He's just bleeding. Two million yen. What? Yeah. This guy again. Then you get beat up. To mommy. They beat him up, right? An official. When did he call him? That's right, he's the Lockhart guy. He's kind of got himself in deep, hasn't he? <laughs> this is a very serious d game of dice. <laughs> oh no, he's stressed. He's getting dizzy. <laughs> There's vomit coming out of one of them. Oh no, the sirens. He freaks out, it's siren noises. <laughs> He's going to be all messed up. Oh shit. It's an alien. Naturally, it's alien dice. Why can't he see that? <laughs> They're right at the front. Oh, uh oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> the magnifying glass? <laughs> You're your mongers. Your mongers.
Genau. <lacht> oh mein Gott. You got him 2 million yen. Yeah, so Rohan and Jojo are not friends. Mario. Mori, Mori, Mario. Mario Radio. I like it. So this kid is the, um... The young boy of the family. Now your father got murdered and got replaced by a psychopathic killer. Um... He knows this, Al? He's watching all the sec sec they got security cameras. Um... Is he going to try and find the Jojos? Is that his mum? Is his mum? Oh, okay. Alien or stand user? He's an alien. He's turning into different things. Highway go go. Oh, <laughs> hello, friend. They're not friends. Joske. Was there a fire in Pretty Woman? It's been a while since I've seen that one. We're getting some murders. Oh shit. Take taking the hand off. Highway go go. Yeah, 
Yes. That's his shtick. He likes to cut people's hands off and then date them. I did not have time to read all that. Are you kidding me? I'm not the kind of reactor to pause and, and rewind and go back. So he's going back into the tunnel, looking for those mysterious doors, but it was the bus, right? So when he was on the bus that he saw the, the stand. Oh no, he's, there is a door. How? What? It's Narnia. It's the wardrobe. It's still getting chased. What is it? It's it's feet. What? Are you sure? On him. Oh shit. Oh, they. Oh. What? What? He's come back into the tunnel. No Rahan. Ooh. What? Whoa. Give me your nutrients. Highway go go. He's turning into a jelly man. He's in trouble. Oh, he's very spooky.
Don't go in the room, man. Illusion, illusion, illusion. Not an illusion. Bait. So the room is a stand. Will he? Yeah, he's more noble than that. You bastard. So that brings him in. Oh, it's so weird. Oh, shit. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> oh, oh, he's moved. Fix the bike. Well, he's not going anywhere. Oh, to be continued. This is so weird. <laughs> I love it, though. Oh, it's, an, it's very clever the way they had that dice game and just built up that animosity between Josuke and Rohan and just really established their relationship as not friendly and then kind of twisting it, putting Rohan into mortal peril and Josuke being the one that has to save him. And Rohan rescuing Jos Josuke by pushing him away. And Josuke being moved by it. So this is really kind of laying the groundwork that their friendship could develop here. But um, it's clever writing. It really is. The way he kind of gets that story laid out. Everything has a payoff. Unless, unless he forgets. You know, when Araki forgets. Well, what about when Dean Barry forgets? Good old Dean, always forgetting things. Highway Go Go Part 2. Episode 20, 29, can you believe it? So Josuke is going to find the user and um, defeat him, and then Rohan and Josuke will be friends for life. 
that's what I think is going to happen. But, like I said, this show just kind of throws my expectations out the window and does its own thing. But it's highly entertaining. So all those feet stand things were supremely creepy. And I've just watched an episode of Steins Gate. Have you watched that one? Where people who time travel and they don't do it right turn into jelly man. They, they don't form properly, so their skin's translucent and they're all jelly and you see their bones in their guts and it's it's not good, it's not very pleasant. So that's why that call out when Rahan was having his nutrients sucked in by Highway Go-Go become translucent, you can see his skull and stuff. I literally just watched that episode of Steins Gate half an hour ago, so it's very fresh. Do you guys watch Steins Gate? If you're my Patreon, you do because it's coming at you. But yeah, good episode, very weird. But I'm really loving the animation in this season. It's It's just so good. And the character designs are nuts. The new opening is good. I love the new song. And I really am enjoying Rohan's character. Although, that whole dice game thing, honestly, I've got to dumb without it. It was very weird and strange. And the alien kid, is he like gone now? No, he'll come back. Because we don't just drop characters in and then not reintroduce them. I mean, that other kid just come back. Tamarari? Tamar Tamarin? And that was, that was funny though when... The fire was in Rahan's house and they had no clue. I was thinking, with all those sirens, why is the fire brigade turning up right up front of his house? It was so weird and there was this raging fire just inside. <laughs> and they didn't notice it because I was so absorbed with the game. <laughs> Let the show flow over you and then just enjoy it for what it is. That's what I've done since day one. It's incredible. Anyway guys, part two coming up. Catch you then. Thanks for watching.